Usman Sonko, a key opposition figure in Senegal's political landscape, has effectively submitted his candidacy to the Constitutional Council. This submission, a crucial procedural hurdle in the race for the presidency, signals Sonko's readiness to face the challenges of the upcoming elections. Currently in prison, Sonko's candidacy came as a surprise to many, especially when the Senegalese administration initially refused to provide him with the necessary sponsorship funds. However, with a determined spirit and relentless pursuit of his political ambition, Usman Sonko has managed to make significant progress in getting his candidacy accepted. The mysterious circumstances surrounding the filing, with Sonko's representative Ayub Dafi being evasive about the filer, only serves to highlight the challenging political climate in Senegal. The submission of Usman Sonko's candidacy, despite his continued detention, is a sign of his political determination. State lawyers have, however, announced an appeal to the Court of Cassation, and if successful, the appeal could potentially disqualify Sonko from the presidential election scheduled for February 2024. The ongoing events surrounding the submission of Sonko's candidacy highlights the complex dynamics of Senegal's political landscape where opposition participation and the integrity of the electoral process are often the subject of public scrutiny and debate.